Hello, how are you doing? This is Brian Shanley. As I observe the political and economic uncertainty that uh, define 2020, 2021, et cetera, and I look at what's gonna happen in the 2022 election or whatever you wanna call it that would be coming up, um, my humble, respectful observation as a person who's been watching politics all of their life is that we have a one-party system that is um, sold as though it's a two-party system. So you've got a two-headed devil in the form of the Republican and the Democratic parties, respectively. And hypothetically, in a, in a fake universe or alternate universe, if I was to throw my name into consideration to run for a political office, to, to be of service to my fellow citizens, whether it be of Minnesota or the United States of America in a broader sense, I don't think I could in good conscience um, identify myself with or receive with favor the endorsement of either of those two parties. So I would be running as either an independent or as some third party. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what the label is on the bottle. It matters what the contents are inside of it. Uh, I could I could have the Bozo the Clown party. It doesn't matter. You know, all that matters is what you're going to do once you get in the office. If the voters will trust you and uh, have you and uh, give you that sacred spot and you flesh it out and you execute it in the way that's going to give them the best chance at freedom and prosperity and happiness uh, to, to give their children a chance at life. Um, it doesn't matter what party you were identified with in the long haul. Uh, you're not gonna be defined by the history books in future generations based on, he belonged to this party. You're gonna be defined by what you did in the office. So yeah, I would not be identifying with either the Republican or the Democratic party. Even if they approached me and asked me, I would probably respectfully tell them no. So it would be third party or no party as an independent. So hope you're doing well. God bless and keep each and every one of you. Thank you for listening.